Ladies and gents, we're going to be closing the MST in a few minutes. Please turn off the computer you're on. Thank you. Hey, Alex. Thanks for a laptop. Hey, no problem, man. See ya. Have a good one. Hey, what's in that room there? Uh, I'm not sure. I think it's just storage. All right. See ya. Ciao. on the grid. What? Wait, wait, you came from Vani? That's radical, man. If you came through the portal, that means it's still active. We can beat this game together. Years ago, when Vani first started around with the robotics competition, somebody came across Tron on that computer. No one ever bothered to play until one guy called Harry tried playing. And then legend has it that he was sucked into Tron, and now he can't get out. I'm Harry. I've been... Trapped in here for a while, I'm a, I, I was a Vani student. Are you a student? Yeah, I, I'm actually part of the Vani Robotics Club. If you came through the portal, that means that not only is the portal still open, but the program's still running. This is our chance to get out of here once and for all. Wait, so how will we get out? So in theory, it's quite simple. All we have to do is win a competition over at the sports complex. So basically what you see here is essentially the Vani College you're used to. We're still, in theory, located in the Saint Laurent region, uh, 821 Saint Croix. The big difference is, of course, the 6,500 students that you're used to seeing are no longer really around here in this in this dimension. Um, but basically, we have to move quickly. We only have a few hours for the portal closes. So, what do we have to do? Follow me. I'll explain on the way. Walk too fast. Walk too fast. What do you mean? What do you mean? Oh, I should have heard a lot. So here's the thing: the rules to challenge of the grid. They're different, they change every year. We've tried this many times in the past, and a lot of people have been derezzed in the process because something always goes wrong. We've learned from our mistakes. This time around, we know the rules and we'll be fine as long as we have your help. Every team starts off with a baton, and each baton transforms into a robot. The goal of the robot is to get balls through hoops that match its team's colors on either side of the field to score points. The color of the hoops can be changed by activating the corresponding switches on the playing field. Once all the hoops are of the same color, so six yellow or six blue, the heat will end, signaling the end of the game. During the preliminary match, three robots form the yellow team and compete against three other robots in the opposing side of the field, which form the blue team. Playing pieces are balls. The game will start with 32 balls on the field. Each ball is worth the same amount of points. Each robot will be allowed two preloaded balls at the start of the game, and all robots will start at the center of the field, which is a large rectangle. <laughs> Your face is a large rectangle. Eli, be serious. If a playing piece leaves the field, it's considered out of play for the duration of the heat. Robots may not damage the game field, the playing pieces, or other robots in any way. Alright, makes sense. But how are we going to do it though? We've been working on something. Wait for it. Here it is. We have to hold a lot of balls to maximize our points, so we're making a large container to hold the balls. Yeah. Like that worked last time, right? But now we improved the system so the balls can't get stuck. Oh, you're using a scissor lift? That's a great idea. Yup, the scissor lift will allow us to bring up the container to the height of the hoops. But what about the ball loading mechanism? Oh yeah, that. We decided to use a conveyor belt style system because it's pretty effective. Especially with these huge balls. We decided to go for a six-way drive to maximize our driving precision during our performance. Wow, seems great. Sounds like we got a decent chance. Legend says that whatever the players face is the most brutal, deadly, terrifying challenge ever. All right, boys, this is it. Huh, doesn't seem that bad. Okay, guys, this is our chance. Are you ready? We can do this.